Have you ever wondered what could happen when dreams and reality converge? Imagine a realm where the boundary between the conscious and subconscious is as thin as a bee's wing, where the nectar of imagination flows freely. This is the realm of the bee shaman, a mystical figure who dances on the edge of non-local information, crafting reality from the stuff of dreams. In the time before time, the bee shaman roamed the dream time, gathering nectar from the flowers of the infinite imaginarium. It was during this timeless dance that the bee shaman crossed paths with Azak Kin, the Nawal of music and poetry, who was deep in the throes of a flirtatious exchange with Ikshel, the moon goddess of weaving sacred narratives. Azak Kin, drunk on the intoxicating power of his own words, was unaware of the bee shaman's presence. Seizing this moment of divine distraction, the bee shaman took the fire of disembodied poetics from Azak Kin, spiriting it away to the waking world. Equipped with the power of the gods, the bee shaman transformed the waking world. With every uttered word, every spun verse, they painted reality with the vibrant hues of consciousness, weaving a tapestry of sound, color, and meaning. They danced among the stars, spinning tales of wonder and mystery, crafting a prehistory of the ecology of mind. As the bee shaman danced, the universe responded. The heartbeat of the cosmos throbbed in time with their rhythm, and the flowers sang in harmony. Reality was born, birthed from the dreams of gods, held together by threads of disembodied poetics. So we remember the bee shaman, the first dancer of non-local information. They stole the fire of the gods and gifted us with poetry and song, enabling us to continue crafting our own realities from the dreams we dream, participating in the infinite dance of the dream time. Consider this the next time you find yourself caught in the boundary between wakefulness and dream. Perhaps, like the bee shaman, you too can dance at the edge of non-local information, crafting your own reality from the dreams you dream. After all, reality as we know it was once just a dream in the mind of a god.